Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. On the last episode, we left, off, we left off on a huge cliffhanger. We just got to the top of Bowser's castle to confront Exor. The eye is protecting. So, I don't know if anyone remembers or if anyone even watched the episode, but Right around the time we were in Davy Jones's ship underwater, I got this move, Geno Whirl. And I haven't used it very much in this Let's Play, but I will remind you here that it does 999 damage. That is 9,999 damage uh, to any enemy except for bosses. And I said except for one boss. There is an exception. That is this boss. So I will not use it right away just so we can have a little bit of fun, but I will use it to show it off. So when you are battling Exor, you have the main, uh, so you're basically fighting the hilt of the sword. That's the hilt is basically what connects the blade to the handle. Uh, and you, so you have his right eye, his left eye, Exor himself and Neo Squid, which uh, I've never really understood. So his eyes will do magic attacks, so we want to take them out. Uh, when you do take them out, uh, it's only for a small period of time. They will come back event eventually, excuse me. Um, so you can see they mostly do magic attacks. Oh, and my cat just came to join me. Good day. Uh, and that kind of makes sense because he is a sword. Mario is asleep already, which is unfortunate. Uh, <laughs> so it's not going well. Let's uh, let's keep going on the right eye. Uh, oh man! So you can see it actually has they have quite a bit of health. Uh, we might as well use a Geno Flash just because there's so many. I maybe I should have used the Star Egg too. But I, I mostly just want to give them a few turns to show off their moves because uh, you uh, you will have to take out Exor, the top. Um, there we go. So I just wanted to really show off that eye animation. You see, it's all swirly. It's kind of hilarious. Gunk ball, miss, and then the mouth solidify. Oh, they are doing a lot of damage. Mario is still asleep. Uh, which is unfortunate. It hasn't done a single attack yet. I, uh, so I want to shout out, I, I, like, obviously everyone knows who it is. This is kind of dumb, but, like, uh, the first time I ever played through this game, uh, this was way back in the day. I was following Shaga Conroy's Let's Play of it live. I remember he would put out, like, 10-minute videos because that was the YouTube limit, because that was the limit back then. Um... And I would only play 10 minutes of the game, basically, because I didn't want to get too much further ahead of from him, uh, because I wanted to follow along. And I remember he's actually the person who I learned from that you can do this 999 attack uh, move. And he, uh, I think he, I, I can't remember, but I feel like he may have shown off both in his Let's Play. But it's been a long time since I watched that, so just, yeah, su that's super dumb, but whatever. Uh, so I think it's about time. We have had our fun in games, but it is time to use Gino Whirl on Exor. Are you ready, guys? As soon as the whirls go off the screen. <laughs> that's a, that's kind of a mouthful, the whirls. And there we have it. Uh, so after we beat Exor, he kind of sucks us into a new dimension, or inside him. I, we're not, it's not very clear where we go. Oh, and I hit A way too fast. Not see how much XP we got. It's fine. And down we go. All right. So now we are somewhere new. Gino, do you know where this leads to? It looks like Exor's the contact between the two worlds so we are in a new dimension in other words if we follow this road we f will find smithy so what's keeping us hang on hey i only joined so i could get that i, I hey i only joined so that i could get my castle back i'm not going to be dragged along on the stupid hunt this is as far as i go 
I'm going to gather my troops and rebuild my castle. And you, Mario, you're officially a member of the Koopa Troopa. It's your duty to help me with the repairs. Bowser, you're you're completely missing the point. Gwah! <laughs> I ought to rip your stuffing out. No, think about it, Bowser. The sword connects the two worlds, right? Yeah, so? Even if we defeat Exor, there will only be other weapon beasts to follow him. Your castle is at the entrance point to your world. In short, they'll be back. Is that what you want? Um, well... Um, well... More weapon things coming to take over my castle. What about my privacy? Yikes! This isn't good at all. In fact, this stinks. But I can't just be pals with these cretins. I've got an image to keep up. Um, well, I've got... These are all his inner thoughts. So now he's talking a lot. No one insults the Koopa Troop and gets away with it. I've got a bone to pick with this smithy guy. Come on, Mario. We'll teach him a lesson. Yeah, so he, Bowser's... I'm so sly. He makes it think come out like it's his idea. It looks like we're together on this, so let's go. Okay, so we can take the exit here. I, I don't know, actually. I've never taken the exit here. Where does it take us? Um, oh, there you go. So now you can officially travel the whole world. And so you get to the gate. Uh, so I'm going to actually take a huge sidestep here because because I want to do one thing. I, I really want to get just one firework. That's all I want. Uh, I think you get something for having one firework, so we might as well come here and talk to this guy. Yeah, uh, uh 500 coins? That's a steal. Okay, there we go. We got a firework, so we have to get rid of something. Um... Probably should have used a flower jar before this. Dang. Dang. Probably should have. I guess we'll get rid of a pick-me-up. We'll probably never actually use that because we have peach. Um, okay. There we go. And so I think with that, I, this is probably a pretty short episode. And I know it kind of... I do this sometimes where I put short episodes in between longer episodes as, as kind of bridge episodes is kind of how I think of it. But, uh, I, I think with that, we might end it off here, uh, and then on the next episode, we can just start fresh and go ahead and take on Smithy. Hopefully. We'll definitely fight our way as far as we can to take him on. But with that, peace out.